Okay, today we've got the Coffee Gator from coffeegator.com. This is the uh, semi-auto espresso machine. Semi-auto espresso machine uh, by the Coffee Gator. They're pretty cool. Um, I'm not a big espresso guy. I've had it. Uh, you know, I don't not like it, but it's just always been a pain to have. And, you know, so this is pretty cool. Uh, we're going to run through some of the things here. So what's included? The espresso machine, the removable water tank, removable water tank right there. All right. It's got a little handle on it. All right. Removable water tank. Uh, adjustable steam wand is right here. It's adjustable. It moves back and forth. Uh, remove the drip tray. The drip tray comes out. Cover plate. Single shot profiler right here, double shot, and the, and the ESE prod profiler cup. And the plastic, a two-in-one tamper spoon is right here. And, the, and your user guide, okay? Now up here on A, you got, uh, you got your power button in the middle, right? And you got your select a knob over here. These, this is your select a knob. The select a knob, it goes from espresso brew if you turn it this way and if you turn it this way it goes to steam when you're steaming the milk all right pretty cool uh the brew head is over here and uh of course the wand all right uh the hot water button is uh over here the power button and the steam button we're going to turn it off because it'll automatically go off in a few minutes all right, uh, and then of course I showed you the selector. Standby is up top, espresso is on the one side, and the other side is hot water steam, all right? Uh, filling the water tank. Okay, so we're gonna put some water in there. There's a minimum, a minimum, a minimum, a minimum, a minimum, a minimum, minimum, and a maximum. So we're gonna put a little bit more, a little bit more than the minimum. How about that, all right? So we put a little bit more than the minimum on there. Put that over there like that, and not really sure I probably should have put it in the cup so slide that right down in there. there's a channel that slides right in there I probably should have poured the cup so I would know how much is in there but we're gonna use that cup there all right so we're now we have it as we go so now you turn the power light on you turn the power on and it's gonna blink until it warms up so then it uh, when the machine is ready both the hot and the steam boil will turn solid red so it turns solid red because I had it on just a minute ago Product is ready and in standby position. Now, uh, making espresso your preferred size. I'm gonna use the small one. We're gonna open up the espresso. You got your little tamper thing here, so you're gonna take that, All right? You're gonna put it in here. I don't know how much I need. And then you tamp it down. All right. Get rid of the excess on there. You don't want any around the edges because then it makes a bad seal, right? You throw it on there, right? Make sure to remove excess espresso grounds from the rim, right? Before locking it in, and insert the port of filter wand into the left side of the brew head socket and twist until secured. Okay, so this gets a little tricky from being back here. Let me move that out of the way. So you go to the left side, and then you bring it over. All right. And you put that under there, obviously. You might want to get a smaller uh, cup in there. Okay, so press your espresso cup over the drip cutouts in the center of the drip plate. And then you turn this to espresso. Boom! And once it fills up to three quarters of the way, you got to turn it back off yourself. It's not automatic. So you got to keep your eye on the water. And uh, here it comes, brewing out. I don't know if you can see that, it's brewing away. <laughs> Espresso time! It's the express way to make espresso. How about that? Da -da 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 -da. So like I said, it gets to be three quarters of the way over. Still plenty of water back here. And it, can, it comes with all different sizes for strengths. I use the smallest strength. All right, so that's about three quarters of the way. Turn it off. There we go. Take that out. All right now, what we do is let's get this out of the way here. You take your milk, right? 
and you put your milk under here and you turn this to the milk side to steam your milk. You steam the milk up and turn that back off. Alright, and then you got your steamed milk. I don't have I don't have a, a good cup for it I'm using the mason jar. And then you put your steamed milk in there and you got your nice espresso. Oh it's delicious. Uh. Not bad, a little sugar would be nice, but I'll take it. Uh, and that's your espresso with the coffee gator. Okay, pretty simple, didn't take that long to do, and even I can do it.